avoid the winning as they play the most exciting game of their lives. From Television City in Hollywood, it's time to press your luck. Thank you, Rod, and welcome to another episode of Press Your Luck, Luck, the Presidential Edition. The show where three historical figures play for thousands of dollars of cash and prizes that are just as realistic as their campaign promises. Today's contestants were selected at random, and they are Chester, Ellen Arthur, Barack Hussein Obama, and Richard Milhouse Nixon. Before we went on the air, we played a speed r- a spin round, and Chester has eight spins, Barack has five, Richard Nixon has seven. Those spins are important because each of them can be worth as much as $5,000 on our big board, which has over $60,000 in cash and prizes. But beware of the whammies. They will take away all of your money, and four whammies will send you home with nothing. The player who is in the lead at the end of this round gets to play last in the final round because that's the spot with the biggest advantage. And remember, if you have a fear of the whammy, you can pass your earned spins to the player with the highest score. We start round one with the player with the least amount of spins. Barack, that's you with five. Let's get the game rolling. And press your luck. No, that's not a great way to start a game, is it? Four spins, one whammy. Press or pass. Nine hundred bucks. You're in first place. Three spins to go. What are you gonna do? Another $1,200 brings you to $2,100, two spins. Press or pass? Going again. Another 1000 brings you to $3,100, one spin. Risking it all in one spin. And nearly doubling it with this 3,000, making it 6,100. We go to player with the least amount of spins of the reigning players. That is Richard Nixon. Seven spins. I'm going to go for it. 750, you're on the board. Six spins to go. Press or pass? What's your pleasure? I'm going to go for it. Spinning again, he gets. Oh, a big number, four thousand dollars, bringing you ever so closer to Barack Obama. With here behind by thirteen fifty. I'm gonna go for it. Going again. Two thousand eleven. At 67.61, you now have the lead by 661 bucks, four spins. I'm gonna go for it. Rolling the board, we get 470. A classic space, if any, I do say so myself. 11.31 is your lead, 72.31 is your total, three spins. I'm gonna go for it. Going again. Move one, space. Move one space, two thousand bucks or seven hundred and fifty and a spin. Take the cash, big money, big money. Two thousand dollars. You got it. You now have nine thousand two hundred thirty-one dollars. What's your pleasure? And they're gonna pass. It. Pass. Rock, you must take them both. You got two spins. You got about three thousand dollars catching up to do. $2,000. Well, you got your 11 in. Now you got 8111. You're behind by 1120. Ooh, that is not good. Two million. Three million five. Not bad for a couple of weeks' work. Want to be 
careful about picking up a third whammy in round one. Yeah, you're gonna be a one termer if you spin anymore here. Or even if you don't spin, if you know what I mean. Okay, Chester. No money, but you got eight spins. You got nine thousand to catch up to do. Let's get started. $525, you're in the chip, seven spins. Alaska, Alaska, 31.67. What will you ask? A? What's your pleasure? Pressing again to get a thousand a spin, 46.92, same six spins, trail by 45.39. Going again. Another $2,500 brings you to $2,039, five spins. Zero notes and zero dollars. Four spins, nine thousand two hundred thirty-one in the hole. Gotta get that first place. Nine hundred dollars. You're about one tenth of the way there. Three spins. What's your pleasure? Move one space. Move one space to Bahamas or 500 in a spin. Take the trip. Stop at the Bahamas. 47.17. That was a good choice. You now have 56.17. You trail by 36.14. Going again. Whammy Bowl Joe Bird. Be careful about picking up a third whammy in round one. Okay, here's what we look at. You got two whammies, you got one spin. Pass to Richard, he whammies, you got a three way tie. We just start the whole darn thing over in round two. I'm going to uh, pass. Sounds like a good idea. We... Can Richard be tricky enough to get out of this jam? No! <laughs> well, we really shook things up that time, didn't we? Chester has zero money. Rock had no money. And Richard has no money. Um, neither does anyone else in the country, so you're all in the same boat. We'll see you on the other side. Round two coming up right after this.